Stinky X Raccoon here, bringing you a live commentary of a match I just had, in and I put it on theater mode, so yeah. Um, yeah. And we'll show it to you right here. So pretty much, in this match, I, at the end, I got a GI unit and a wraps, but throughout the, the beginning of the match, I was doing horrible, because I, was, I wasn't focused. But in in round two, I ended up going 70 and 30. It's 70 something to 30 something. But pretty much, you'll see this, and it was like crazy at the end of this match. Um, pretty much, I used the RK5, and I got I killed someone. It like you'll see it. You'll see the clip when we get to it. You'll see it, and it was the most craziest thing you'll ever see. Let me see if I can. But yeah. I don't know why the score streaks don't pop up. But yeah. This was a pretty crazy match. It was incredible. But yeah. Day five and four. Yeah. But yeah. Um. It's about 15 minutes long. That's pretty good. It's not bad. Oh yeah. We'll just watch it. Whatever. But if you guys, I hope you guys have been liking the videos because I haven't been uploading as much and like in the past in a long time, um, like in about five years. It was, you know, I didn't never really got into it, and then it was like, I don't know, it was hard. But, it's just, you know, I want to become, I wanted to become a successful YouTuber. My, people were like, telling me, saying that I'm like, I can be a very, I can be a successful YouTuber. I could probably be big on YouTube. Because I could be very funny and stuff. But, you know, it's just tough times right now. You know, I'm a senior in high school. It's just hard, you know what I mean? And, my mom had a stroke the day after Christmas. Of this year, this Christmas we just had. She had stroke dad's Christmas, and I'm, you know, it was. I was 18, you know. It, it was hard, you know. And being next to kin from my mom, you know, it was. It was hard, you know. what I mean, but we're we're poor, you know. What I mean, we don't. I I work and I co-op, you know. And it's. My parents don't have no jobs. My dad don't have doesn't have no doesn't have no money income anymore. Um. It's just, you know, it's hard, you know? And that's why I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go on YouTube and try to be successful, you know? Do what I can do. Um, it's just hard doing this kind of thing. Um, I mean, I'm, tr I'm, tr I'm gonna upload as ma many videos as possible, you know, for you guys. Even though I don't have that many subscribers, but it will grow. It takes time. Like McJugger Nugget says, and. Sunday and all the other YouTubers, you know what I mean? It's out, shout outs to them, you know, like PewDiePie and Jacksepticeye, Markiplier, Smosh, you know, Dashi, all those guys, you know, it's, it's, it's what people like, you know, it's, you just gotta take a taste for it, you know, it's, I mean, not many people would like my videos, but you know, if they don't like them, just tell me, you know? But if I mean share this, share my channel with people, you know, get, tell them, give me sh shout outs or mention it to your friends. Say, hey, look at this guy. This guy is pretty cool. You should check him out, you know. Like my friend Bioglass, he my fr my best friend. I know him for a long time. He um shout outs to him, you know. Give him a shout out. Follow, get subscribe, get, like and subscribe to him. Shout outs to Optic Predator. The Optic Predator. And uh or, or in DSW Predator. Shout outs to him. DSW Predator, he is one of my good friends from high school. He he uh just you know gave me some tips and tricks and you know mainly tips on YouTube how to become successful, you know. Shout outs to him, he's pretty cool. Really cool guy, trust me. But, yeah, heading into the second round. 
going into the second round. Yeah. She's down. Kill that guy. Am I gonna kill him here? Yeah. Oh yeah. Ooh, got lucky. And right there. We lost that engagement. Regroup and go again. What, bro? Yeah, you're a good doggy. And that Rue is my dog, guys. Just gave you guys a heads up again. And this is pretty much where <laughs> where you are currently going. Twenty-two to sixteen. Remember this. See this. Just watch the score. Hundred to hundred. A hundred to eighty-nine. Okay. Now watch. See this KD right here. Twenty. It's twenty-two and sixteen. That sixteen is going to be a thirty, and that twenty-two is going to be in the seventies. Watch. You'll see. Near the end. And that's the RK5. The RK5 is really powerful up up close. That thing's powerful. See why the uh, competitive players use it in the in the league. And in competitive play, it's very powerful. It's the luckiest on baddest grenade. I just play horrible a couple times, you know? Maybe one day I'll get shout out by Astro Gaming, cause or and Scuff Gaming and all them. You know what I mean? It'll be pretty cool because I actually like. And to be honest, guys, I gotta let you guys. If you guys want to become like pretty good at Call of Duty and stuff, I recommend some Astro Gaming headsets. I mean, you know, they were always good in the past. I gave them. I was like, I always wanted to get a pair, so I got a pair of 8040s last year with my own money. I saved up. And I just heard, and with the mix amp, this was when I was on Xbox, it was like, on Xbox One, it was, they were, they changed everything, like, it was just, the sound quality was so good. I mean, the sound quality was so good. And, right now, I have the newest ones, the A50s, the new wireless ones, they, they're phenomenal, you know. I put, I played, uh, um, Resident Evil Biohazard with these things. And that's why you had before I got these I was playing that the demo in the summertime with them with the A40s. Oh man, that was the scariest thing. All you hear is weird creepy noise and everything. These this headset these head this kind of headset brings out the sound quality in games. I mean I had Turtle Beach back then on Xbox 360, but I mean I, nothing against it, Turtle Beach, you know. I always used them, I didn't know, you know. They're pretty good. Scuff Gaming, you know, they're pretty cool. They help competitive players, you know, increase accuracy and all that. Like Ali A said, he never goes to a tournament without his scuff controller. Most people that are competitive players, they just they don't go they don't go to tournaments without their scuff controllers. And as you guys can see here, watch it, watch it. Wait, hold on, I think this might be it. Is this it? Maybe. Maybe I don't know. Hold on, let me see. Yeah, it's coming up. I don't even know what happened there. That was crazy. <laughs> Boom, missed the shot. I think this is where I do get my wraps. I think. I can't remember. Hold on. I just played the match like two matches ago. But hold on, we'll see. Yeah, we'll get the wraps here. And that was the craziest thing. I when I killed that guy, he scared the shit out of me. And I, I'm actually surprised I killed him. Once I killed him, I just I was in my chair and I just jumped right back and scared the shit out of me. Yeah, but we're about to get the wraps. Watch my hand when it there the wraps. Now the craziest gameplay you guys are ever gonna see. I have ever had, and you'll see. Just watch. Watch this. But yeah, pretty much once I just, I was like, I didn't know what to do with the wraps, you know, I didn't know what to do. I was like, do I go out there and and, and give and try to get the GI unit? And because I was trying to get it, should I go out there and uh, risk it? Or should I stay up here? And what, you guys can't see the score, the uh, score streaks uh, meter on the right because I'm uh, theater mode. But I was 10 points. When I go down the garage, I was t I had ten. Once I go down the garage, sorry. Once I go down in the garage, 
I was 10 points off from getting my GI. I'm 10 points off from getting my GI. I can't speak today. Now watch this. Watch this kill. Watch this death. Watch. Now right. Hold on. Let me pause the kill feed. Hold on. Oop, didn't want to do that. Go down here. I'm gonna show you guys again. Hold on. We'll get to it real quick. Hold on. Sorry about that. Now watch. Now right there. Watch. Right there. That guy. I killed the guy right before he killed me. I got the GI unit. Yeah. That was pretty crazy though. <laughs> it just. A split second, I after that I I still got the GI unit. Just, that was just crazy. Get me some Overwatch. I was I'm pro I'm happy about that. That was just that was some crazy shit right there, man. That was awesome. That was beautiful that I got that. But just killed a bunch of guys. Now watch. Oh, now look. Remember when I said uh, watch the thing. Told you it's gonna hit. This absolute decimation, this, the GI unit just goes to town, man. <laughs> it just racks up the feet, I just feel so bad for the other team. Once I hit level 55, or, uh, level, I think it's 51, level 51, whatever level it is, I'll, I'll, I'll go for a mothership. Yeah, I will get it, a live commentary for that. I'll get my live reaction. And if I can't get it on on film, then I'll just go to the theater and I'll get it for you guys. But yeah. But yeah, that was that game, guys. Now, 74 to 32. That's pretty good. Now. Remember to hit that like and subscribe button for more content. And Sneaky X Raccoon here, I'll see you guys later.